Another schematic that I like to share with my uh, attendees is the, direct, the differences between correction, corrective action, and preventative action. We all have, as I said, some things that might not go as we planned in the pharma industry. Uh, so we have a lot of uh, corrective action plans, but a lot of times people get confused as to what that may mean. Um, am I correcting it? Do I correct it right away? Or is this more of a long-term type of action for me to fix the problem? So I put this schematic together to show you how there's a lot of differences between our terminology when it comes to correcting and prevent preventing um, actions that we may want to uh, fix in the future. The first thing we want to look at is the uh, person in the, in the top row, he's putting out a fire. Um, that's the correction. He's putting the fire out at the time that it's actually occurring. The second little picture we have there is two employees. They're talking about the fact that they had a fire last week. As you can see, the one employee is actually smoking near the boxes, which are obviously are highly flammable. So as they're talking about it, perhaps they're thinking, you know, I wonder what caused the fire? How can we prevent the occurrence? This is going to go um, after the event occurred. And then the last thing you see is the preventative action. So through that middle conversation that those two employees have had, they may have gone over some of the things that um, might be a little bit faulty in that second picture, and they thought, you know what, there's a, there's a root cause. That could be our, um, our smoking gun. Let's put up a no smoking sign and really stop the fire from happening again. This could actually occur before the event happened or even after the event happened. As you'll see in later slides, that preventative action really doesn't have to be associated with something that has gone wrong. It can be a very uh, good proactive approach uh, that you can do and really prevent things from going wrong before, uh, before you get there.